is Kat McKinnon with CSCH, and today we're going to talk a little bit about microclimates. And as an example, we're going to look at these little guys. So this is a cactus, and you can see growing beneath it a little bit of moss, and coming up from the bottom, it's just dried out, but this is actually a fern. This is an unusual combination. We don't usually think of cactus growing with ferns and moss. But the reason this is able to happen is because this cactus is creating what we call a microclimate. In the southwest, when you're looking for medicinal plants, microclimates are important to look at simply because they're islands right, of moisture or of shade or of heat where plants tend to congregate. In this case, the microclimate is made by this cactus. It's collecting just enough moisture and creating just enough shelter from snow for this moss and this fern to be able to have set their spores and sprouted with it. If you're interested in more, check out our website, clinicalherbalism.com, and stay tuned for more videos.